morning. It's uh, six thirty in the morning. We have a clear blue sky. Uh, it's freezing cold out now. It's about minus six, minus seven degrees centigrade. And uh, here we have the beautiful Tom Tom village. And towering above it is the Mount Taulagiri. You can also see the airport in there. So yeah. Let's get started. three of our Mustang travel adventure and today we will be visiting the holy spiritual site of Muktinath region, exploring the ancient Buddhist Kumbhas and relaxing by the lakeside of beautiful Tumba Lake. So let's get started, it's a beautiful journey today. These are mountain goats, also known as Changra in Nepali. They love mountain. So it's a beautiful drive up the high mountain roads in Nepal. So from Jomsom to Muktinath, it's about uh, an hour drive. And we will be climbing an elevation gain of 1,000 meters. As you can see, the road is uh, is a dirt track. It's not, I wouldn't say off road, but it's like a very nice, well, gravel road. It's quite comfortable to ride. But anyhow, we have uh, high mountains with no vegetation. All of these peaks over 4,000 meters high. High Himalayas surrounding us. And beneath us is the Kali Gandaki Basin. So it's one of the one of the major river in Nepal. So yeah, let's 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 get going. <laughs> the road can get quite bumpy, but that's that's quite fun. It's adventurous. So yeah, visit Mustang. Truly beautiful. It's our third time, but every time it feels like our first time. No stay. <laughs> The road section towards Muktinath region is very nice, well paved, and after driving uphill for around 10 minutes, we have now arrived at this beautiful scenic viewpoint where we will be stopping by to marvel the beauty surrounding us and have some fun. So introducing this uh, tours to drivers. Yeah. Me, myself, and our Suresh Tamang brother. Hello, hello, everyone. Yeah, he also has a YouTube channel. Be sure to check it out. I'll link it up in the description down below. Yeah. Anyhow, Suresh, ji, how are you doing? 
एकदम रमाइलो भइरहेको छ हैन आज चाहिँ हामी कागबेनी माथि सेल्फी डाडामा सेल्फी पोइन्टमा आइबोया छौ अब सेल्फी खिच्दै एकदम रमाइलो गर्दै छौ हैन रमाइलो गर्दै छौ अ दिस इज नोन एज सेल्फी डाडा हो दिस इज सेल्फी पोइन्ट सो यु टेक सेल्फी फोटो सेल्फी भिडियोज लाइक दिस बट एनी हाउ वी आर सराउन्डेड विथ माउन्टेन्स अल ओभर अस है हिमालय हिमाल छ है सुरेश हिमालय हिमाल हजुर हजुर वरीपरी हिमाल अग्ला अग्ला चुचुरा नीलगिरी धौलागिरी एकदम ब्यूटिफुल भिजिट मुस्तांग हाई This is a scenic location you shouldn't miss. Surrounded by high mountains up this high mountain desert, beyond the village of Kagbeni that you see down below, you can relax, take some nice selfies, and if you're willing, take a horse ride. कस्तो लागि रहेछ त केटाहरू एन केटीहरू After enjoying our time at the selfie point, it's time to head back up the mountain to us Muktinath. It is a beautiful day today. Clear with blue sky. Just perfect. Now, we will be gaining some elevation as we climb up this scenic mountain road and it will take about an hour's drive to reach our destination. Nevertheless, let's take it slow and enjoy the beautiful landscape that surrounds us. Okay, so we have reached on top of this hill and there is the parking spot for the vehicle and from there we will be walking uphill towards the holy mountain temple of Muktinath. So welcome to the Muktinath region. Muktinath Valley is located at an altitude of 3710 meters at the foot of Thoranglah mountain pass. From here on we will leave our vehicle and walk up towards the temple of Muktinath which is situated at an altitude of 3800 meters we have left our vehicle in the parking lot is a newly constructed parking lot last time we came here there was no parking space but now there is a good facility of parking space so now it's uphill up this mountain towards the Muktinath temple walking through the barren landscape up to a picturesque settlement we make our way towards the temple complex it is a short uphill hike and there are many souvenir shops and restaurants along the way that's high mountain pass of thorang pass over 5400 meters So it's uh, an itinerary of the Annapurna circuit 
and if you cross this pass you reach the Manang and from Manang we cross this pass towards Mustang We are climbing the stair up towards the Muktinath temple. Down below is the Muktinath region and above we can see the spectacular view of high Himalayas. Situated at an altitude of 3,800 meters, the temple of Muktinath is a highly venerated sacred place for both Hindus and Buddhists. Hindus call the site Mukti Chhetra, which literally means the place of salvation. Buddhists call Muktinath Chumingyatsa, which in Tibetan means hundred waters. A distinguishing feature that adds to the uniqueness of this temple complex is the presence of 108 sacred fountains. Designed in the shape of a cow's head, these fountains run along the temple wall. Throughout the year, pilgrims from Hindu and Buddhist tradition make their way to this sacred site. They believe that bathing in these fountains serves as a ritual of purification. Additionally, the site is believed to be a manifestation of Avalokitesvara, the Bodhisattva of compassion and virtue. The Tibetan Buddhist tradition states that Guru Rinpoche, also known as Padmasambhava, the founder of Tibetan Buddhism, meditated here on his way to Tibet. So we are currently at an elevation of 3,850 meters above sea level. We are here at the holy site of Muktinath region. The Muktinath region houses the Muktinath temple, which is holy for Hindus as well as Buddhists. And around the Muktinath complex, uh, we can see a lot of Gumbas as well. So this Gumba is uh, a Gumba for Padmasama, Guru Padmasama. So if you are visiting the Muktinath region, be sure to come by to this spiritual location. It's a very relaxing place, beautiful ambience. Uh, we are surrounded by high mountains. In fact, in the backdrop, we have some of the highest Himalayas in the world. Look at it. This is truly spectacular. Beautiful. Next to the Muktinath temple, we can find the biggest stone statue of Lord Buddha in Nepal. The 32 feet tall statue of Sakyamuni Buddha is carved from the special stone from the village of Harping by Newar artisans in Patan of Nepal. The statue sits in a peaceful location overlooking the town of Muktinath region.
so this location is also known as Jwala Mai and uh, here is a natural wonder there is an eternal flame so there you can see the flame it's blue in color it's burning off of natural gas we have descended from the Muktinath temple the current time is uh, about 11.30 and now it's time for some much needed coffee break and it's none other than legendary Mr. Bob Marley Hotel Oh, okay. Okay. Subscribe is spelling as you Subscribe. Art by Nepal360. Like, share, and subscribe. Now it's an uphill drive to us to Bale. Now below we can see the town of Jomsom. So you can see from here we have uh, the airport of Jomsom. Jomsom town. And then there is also a very nice hotel over there. It used to be called Moksha Mustang. Now it goes by Shintamani Mustang. It's a five star hotel. As you can see, the road is uh, pretty steep uphill. And sometimes it gets gnarly, but most of the time it's just a plain gravel road. It sure is an adventurous ride here in Mustang. Tumba Lake is the hidden gem of Mustang region. It is emerald green in color and lies at the altitude of approximately 2,900 meters at the base of Mount Nilgiri, which is the main source of this lake. There is an interesting story behind this lake, as per the locals. Legend says that the lake water once turned into reed, and only after long devoted religious ceremonies performed by Tibetan Buddhists that the water returned to its natural color. So it's been since considered a sacred lake.
that was a very windy experience at Dumba Lake. But I think the charm of Dumba Lake is the wind. So it, it, it creates a surreal atmosphere. Anyhow, we are now going back to Jomso to have some much needed lunch. And we are heading back to our brother Pranis Plazan's hotel for some tasty momo. Right. Mustang famous momo. Mustang's famous momo. If you're in uh, Mustang, you should head out to his uh, momo uh, restaurant. And also, speaking of Dumba Lake, if you are visiting Mustang, don't miss Dumba Lake. It's a very beautiful scenic location. Just enjoy, sit back, relax, take your time. All your stress, all your tension will go away. But anyhow, let's get back. Back again on the off road system. Now something that I would also like to mention is uh, the ethnicity of Mustang. So the majority of people here are Thakali. They have a very strong culture and uh, very authentic houses. So you can see these houses here, these villages, these are all Thakali villages. And uh, speaking of Thakali people, something that is quite famous about them is the food. The Thakali food. So you will never miss out the Thakali lunch when you are at Mustang. Authentic, original Thakali food. Make sure to try it. And once again on the rickety breeze, as you can see, there you go. And if we venture up towards the upper Mustang section, then the ethnicity changes. There you would find uh, more Tibetan people. Uh, with the Tibetan idyllic rural landscape and Tibetan culture. There are ancient gompas and stupas, 10th century old and it's, it's a totally different place. So take a look at our Mustang adventure video for, for an exciting adventure that we did back on a motorcycle, motorcycle adventure. So that's something that's quite interesting. By the way, if you are deciding to go to Lumantang, uh, for foreigners, there is a permit fee of about $500 for one person. But for Nepalese, there is no permit fee. And uh, if you are coming to Mustang, don't miss out on Upper Mustang. It's a beautiful place. Every video so much. Okay, so just had an amazing momo at the Pranisa Momo restaurant at Pranis. Ah, Pranis, why? Shopping time. So now it's time to do some shopping, much needed shopping. Jomsom Marfa is famous for its apple, tasty apple. These are the local produce, the apples. We also have some Mustang potato and uh, garlic, local garlic. And these are like beans and lentils. Dried apples. Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> 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 Try it. Thank you. Mm, Dried apples. 
Okay, we had an amazing time at Mustang. It has been an adventurous journey going up to the Muktinath Temple, to the beautiful pristine Dumba Lake, and really the journey that the distance that we have covered through these high mountains, these beautiful terrains, it has been an absolute joy. So we highly recommend everyone to try it out. Visit Mustang, try out the culture, try out the local cuisine, enjoy and marvel at the beautiful views surrounding us. And yeah, thanks for watching the video till the very end. And if you like this video, please feel free to share it hit that thumbs up button and stay posted for more adventure from Nepal 360. Thank you so much. This is my kingdom. Oh, oh. Kingdom to Sarah Dami. Oh, but I'm not going to be able to get it. I'm not going to be able Next time, see how I'm going to get it. I'm I'll tell you, 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 i